and also Fast and Furious 6. This building on the right hand side is a wonderful Art Deco building belonging to a charity. But if you went back to the 1730s, there was a young man called Robert Morris, and he was born here. And he went to America at the age of 13, <coughs> joined his father, and he became very rich. And uh, he was a person who signed three of America's greatest documents, that is the uh, Declaration of Independence, the Confederation, and the Articles of uh, the Confederation and the Constitution. And he was a Liverpool person. George Washington also said that he was the person who simply, who simply, uh, without his money, <coughs> the revolution would never have happened. This street is called Dale Street, and Dale Street's full of eclectic buildings that you can see, particularly on their left-hand side. And this was the financial insurance banking area of Liverpool. Going back to Robert Morris, he was so important in that he gave all the American troops the uh, promissory notes so that the American Revolutionary Army would get paid, would get paid. And so therefore he's very, very important. And talking about insurance and things like that, we have the Prudential Assurance, we also have Sun Life, Royal Sun Life, and they were, whenever we had the great disaster in the fire of Chicago. They paid out everything, but the reserves were never touched. So a huge amount of insurance and financial clout here within Liverpool, particularly in the 19th century. There's a building that's sticking out on the right-hand side, and that's our town hall. And it was built around about 1750s. And at the very top, you'll see some very interesting fascias. And there are fascias of leopards, African ladies, elephants, crocodiles, and cameras on the right-hand side. And you see, unfortunately, we come into a difficult part of our history here within Liverpool because we were responsible for the transatlantic trade. We were the biggest port in the transatlantic trade. And we were responsible for bringing 1.5 million people over from Africa to the Caribbean and to the southern states of America. This street is called Water Street. And again, bank buildings. And this huge big building on the left-hand side is called the India Buildings. It was the home of the Blue Funnel Line, which dealt with uh, an area called East India. And we also have New Zealand House and West African House here. And East India basically meant China, India, Japan, and Korea. Now, to orientate you, the building on your right-hand side is again the Liva building. And your ship is right behind it. And you'll see the birds on top that I was talking about earlier on, Bertie and Bella. You should be able to see that from everywhere around Liverpool. And your ship is right behind there. But also that particular building, if anybody's seen a film called Batman with Robert Patterson, that's actually Gotham City. So all that you have to do is to head for the Liver building or Gotham City and your ship is right behind there on the right hand side. So right beside the Liver building is the Cunard building. The Cunard building is after Samuel Cunard, the Canadian.